So one of the next things I'd like to talk to you about uh, for physical fitness is aerobic and anaerobic activities. Uh, I like to simplify it a little bit for, for myself and I just think about balance and I need to have a balance between uh, activities that uh, involve more long distance uh, uh, running or biking or things of that nature and then combine that with on, on different days or, or uh, different times where I'll have uh, activities that are shorter duration, um, maybe a little more intense uh, or um, where I'm working harder on my strength activities. And so this is a little bit of a change from where I grew up. When I uh, first started working out, there was a lot of just straight strength training on weights. And then as I was getting ready for football or basketball or track, there was the running piece of it. And now we see a, a little bit more of a combination of those activities where even as I'm lifting weights, um, I can put in some anaerobic and aerobic type activity. So I can do lighter weights and I can be pushing uh, for longer time frames or I can do some heavier weights and, and get more of that anaerobic push. Or it doesn't even need to involve weights. There's a lot of activities you can do in your house uh, that uh, don't require any weights whatsoever. You can do burpees, you can do uh, push-ups, sit-ups, things of that nature where you're going to get some of the same benefits, uh, anaerobic benefits that we've talked about. And then you can go out for a nice run or you can get on your bike and get some of that aerobic fitness in there. So again, for me, it's a balance. Uh, you'll see as, as you look at my workouts, there's going to be pieces of both of those uh, mixed throughout the day, throughout the week as, uh, as I execute my uh, fitness program.